Hi, I'm Jennifer Trimble. I am with the Redline GEC team. I'm a geotechnical engineer that is focusing on subsurface investigations throughout the entire corridor. Our team is doing subsurface explorations across the entire alignment for both surface and tunnels to get an idea of what subsurface conditions we have um, across the alignment to support what we're proposing to build. Typically we mobilize um, a drill rig and several support vehicles. The drill rig is an oversized truck and then two or three um, just F-150 small pickup trucks. Around our work zone, we typically have several cones to delineate our work area from the traveling public, whether that be the pedestrians or the motorists. This includes also notifying them ahead of our work zone where things are happening. The size of the holes that we make in the field are typically six to eight inches in diameter at the ground surface, and that's created using hollow stem augers, who are basically corkscrewed into the ground like you would try to open like a bottle of wine. And then from there, we take soil samples that are roughly one and a half to two inches in diameter, and then the rock core we obtain is two inches in diameter as well. Another thing that we are also doing while we're in the field is verifying the depth of groundwater in the area because that is seasonal and it fluctuates. So we are also installing groundwater monitoring wells for us to understand the long-term location of groundwater in the project area. We are currently in preliminary design right now, which we're doing preliminary borings, but we are probably going to be doing field work for the next two or three years at least.